Hello everyone and welcome to another video. This is not a faction spotlight, it's nothing like that. Today we're going to be doing a comparison between two great units, the Praetorian Cav and the Cataphract Cav. Which one is the better cavalry unit? Which is the best cavalry unit in the game? It's one of them and we're going to find out which one it is. Now, before you, th you, you think that this is really straightforward, let me show you the stats of the Praetorian Cav and the stats of the Cataphract. Wait, it's the other way around. The stats of the Praetorian Cav and the stats of the Cataphract right here. And as you can see, the, the Praetorian Cav has higher attack and a little bit higher, lower defense. But the Cataphract has a massive advantage on his, uh, on his sleeve that you cannot see running in the game. Let's go and have a look at what that is and maybe make some test runs, right? I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, so this is the first battle and we are running in. We are playing as the Romans. Of course, we have to do the tests all with both factions, right? First we fight as the Romans and then we fight as the Parthians. And right here on this fight, medium difficulty, we are seeing that the Romans are winning despite not being not not winning too uh, mightily. But they are kind of winning. So is the Cataphract unit the better unit? Because we're playing on medium. They don't have any advantage over 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 the Romans. Well, we'll have to wait and see. But after this, we're going to try it on hard and then on very hard. So let's watch this. So, of course, with uh, the Romans, we won the first battle, but we lost the two other battles, which is, you know, not very surprising. They are cataphracts, and we're going to be talking about why that is. Why did they win? All right, let's go. Let's check out how the, playing as Parthia, how do we do against them? Alright guys, all of the battles are done and the Cataphracts won 5 out of 6. The Cataphracts won on hard and very hard when I was playing as the Romans and they won on every single difficulty from medium to very hard when I was playing as the, the Cataphracts, where I, when I was playing Parthia. Now, why did they win? Why is this? Because the stats are very different and if we just look at the stats, the Praetorian Cavs obviously win. And I have actually stated in my videos that the Praetorian Cav is the best unit of Cav in the game, but is it really? No, I was wrong about that. And I have to thank one of my viewers, Sir Aaron Rommel, for letting me know that I was wrong about this. So if the stats of both units favor the Praetorians, why do the Cataphracts win in such a massive way? This has to do with the picture that you are seeing here. Look at the attack. They have 7 attack with spears, but they have 9 attack with maces. And this means that when they are in melee, they put their maces. So they charge with spears and then they put their maces on, and they have 9 attack with them. And on top of that, the mace is a blunt weapon, and as such, they will ignore all the armor of their opponents. And this is where the trick lies. Look at the amount of defense that a Praetorian has. It has 11 armor. If you take those 11 out, the Praetorian Cavalry will only have 11 defense and you will be left with a unit that has just 11 attack and 11 defense. So despite the low attack on the Cataphracts, that means that the Cataphracts will, a will be able to defend a lot more than the Praetorians and as such they will dish out a lot more damage than the Praetorians. And as such, the Cataphracts are the best cavalry unit in the game, for sure. So if you're playing Parthia, use them. Use them. Because on the campaign I'm currently playing on stream, 
I am able to defeat army after army after army of Romans without having to replenish my units of cataphracts just by spamming them. This unit is brilliant, it's perfect and it's mightily overpowered. So use the goddamn cataphracts guys. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one.